what's up everybody, Gaming19 here, and today we're back in from the depths with another one of my showcasings. Today we got another tournament entry but it's not the Battleship Brawl, like I've done with the last 5 or 6. No, it's a different tournament, hosted by the, 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 the hang on. Hosted by the Gemma. The team deathmatch. Which is something that's never happened before. Which is 3v3. 3v3 from the depths. And surprisingly, the tournament is going well. I mean, my ship has won one and lost a fight. But it didn't go down without said fight. Anyway, this is the Anata no so Red Day, which is Japanese and means by your side in English. Now, to start off, this thing is literally made of wood and alloy with a bit of metal towards the lower half of the ship for torpedo defense. It features a lot of laser guided missiles and it has a pretty deadly um, laser can dual laser cannon on the front with 704 pulse damage, a range of one no ten thousand meters and six armor piercing. That's per five a piece and there's two of them. As for its third Ornament, ornament is got six very long torpedoes that are fuel packed and explosive explosives packed. This thing could be capable of sinking a battleship if it tried, because explosive warheads or missiles get a buff in water. It's also got a good la laser anti-missile system with some nodes located on the front which will be 8 and about 12 or 15 located on the back its repair capabilities are kind of bad with only 8 repair bots its superstructure is one of my com commonly used designs on all ships because I can't build anything better with a tiny, probably probably oversized smokestack for a ship the size of 144 meters, width of 15 and height of 18. As for these missiles, they are two things: a verbal thruster, five fuel tanks. A target prediction guidance, one turn, four fragmentation warheads set to one degrees, so all the frags are going to go into, so 50 razor sharp frags are going to go into a cone of one degrees, and there's 200 of them, one explosive warhead and a laser designated receiver, and these things are capable of destroying anything on the surface and most likely in the water. The ammo is a bit oversized and not well protected. This thing could last one heat shell before it destroys. But it's three meters away from the hull so it will survive. Or the ship will and so will the AI, but barely. As for these lambs, they have 1,035 pulse damage and with a range of 10,000 meters and 11 on a patient. But they don't really do much. 
as far as I've seen. Its speed isn't great. And it reaches 9.5 meters a second. It's also got asymmetric thrust, so it should help with turning a bit. But this wasn't done on purpose. It was actually accidental, but I couldn't be bothered fixing it before I sent it in. But it hasn't made much of a difference. As for turning, Turning great is and fast now it's definitely not good. But then again, it's built by me gaming nineteen, it's gonna be terrible. Now these missiles are the same as the ones on the back of the ship except they've got Two less fuel tanks and two less fragmentation warheads. And it's a laser beam rider, meaning whatever that laser aims at, these missiles will follow it. But it's on a turret, so I don't think it works. As for the texture, and it's got reasonable. If you count it all in one little space, reasonable than it is. Oh, the ship can go 10.5 meters per second. That's still terrible. So, I guess all I'll do now is just put in a reward, a reward and see how well it does. Apparently, this laser can shred it. Don't see that happening. I also don't see those missiles doing anything. The laser shot itself. Well, that's to be expected. And the missiles are coming in. And they definitely have the fuel for that range. And the health is dropping fast. I think there's about 30 missiles on the back, maybe more. No, actually, just 80. No, oh, there's that. Yeah, there's 80. and the lasers and the missiles are causing lag. The torpedoes aren't anywhere to be seen. And the laser is now shredding the marauder along with those missiles on the back. And as I said, these missiles on a turret are doing absolutely nothing. The torpedoes I don't think are connected yet. Got no idea in the, where, the, where in the world they are. Well, those things have a lot of fuel, so they should go for and detonate more missiles. I think it's safe to say we the. AI has caught out the ship here. No, nope, those torpedoes are nowhere to be seen. But that doesn't really matter. As the laser and missiles are doing a perfectly good job of coring this thing.
Bring my torpedoes run away. Cause they're not here. Oh no. There you go. One hit. And that one was enough to uh, send this thing to this one. I love the torpedo fight. Okay, right, there's a hundred and nine missiles and two eighty five pieces. And the majority of the missiles are, of course, located in this very lightly armored box of wood. But they get the job done. So I can't argue with that. But anyway, this is the International Sober Day by me, Game19. And there's nothing else to showcase about this. So, if you like the video, leave a like. Comment down below any suggestions. I'll take them into consideration. And why not subscribe if you want to see more. Anyway, I'll see you next time. Goodbye.